Canadian prairies, I've seen a lot of ponds. These are some of the coolest ponds that I've seen. However, the spillways that have been placed into the pond walls are currently causing the walls to fail. In this video, I'm going to explore why they're failing. And in a future video, we'll talk about how to set these spillways up correctly. Right now, I'm in central Alberta looking at a series of dams. And there's some really interesting things to note here. Number one, it's tough probably to hear in the video, but there's a creek that flows all year round coming through this little system here. So that makes dam construction really difficult. Number two, what's really interesting about the way this guy set up these dams is there's a, a series of them that kind of cascade and flow into each other, which is really neat. It's very permaculture-esque. Um, but unfortunately, if you can notice on the dam to the right there, the way that the spillway has been designed, um, the water has basically cut a giant channel through the dam wall which is eventually going to compromise the entire system. And over the last couple of years, I've watched these ponds essentially get destroyed over and over and over again. And luckily this gentleman has an excavator so he can come and fix it on a regular basis. But this is not really a good solution. Ideally, he'd provide a better spillway, which would provide a much more passive way to dispose of or move the water from one pond to another. The pond to the left there struggles from the same difficulties as well. And again, the spillway is built right into the actual pond wall itself, which in torrents of rain will actually compromise the integrity of the pond wall. Having water on your land can create multiple benefits for you. Number one, it can drought proof your property. Two, you can get fire protection from having a surplus amount of water. Three, you can see microclimate effects, so it can actually improve the growing conditions around the actual pond itself. And four, you can have major productivity gains on your property, specifically around aquaculture. But it can also provide hydration for your livestock and uh, anything else that you want to do with water. And lastly, water can provide an incredible recreation opportunity for your property. However, water is also really dangerous if it's not managed properly. And so if you're going to set up a pond, it's really important that you set up that spillway properly so that you don't end up with cataclysmic effects. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you want these videos brought to your inbox every week, sign up to our newsletter at virginpermaculture.ca. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below.